Good morning, y'all. I have been uh, running around like a chicken with its head cut off. <laughs> um, I have. Good been, morning, y'all. I have been a busy bee this morning already. I have a lot of stuff to get done. We're actually getting ready to head to Walmart and get some stuff for groceries, or get the groceries, I should say. Um, yeah, busy day. And then I've got to can some tomatoes. I wanna make some bread. Um, we're gonna do sausage and pepper hoagies this evening. So I need to make some of that Bama, white Bama barbecue sauce or Bama white barbecue sauce. I can't remember. I'll have the recipe and stuff linked down below for it. So we need to get to the grocery store real quick. So I'm going to throw me on some flip flops. I just walked the dogs. I don't know how long this vlog will be, but at least you'll have something. <laughs> but we're gonna go ahead and head on up the road. As you wake up my soul today I feel the hope when your sun shines on my face Oh, I'll wake up with your grace While the moonlight still fading away I see your mercy coming with the day Oh some Starbies and now we're gonna go and wait on the groceries I got a white chocolate mocha frappe with whipped cream and a caramel drizzle I hope that car is not pulling through kind of looks like he was oh that's good Walmart parking lot is tricky. Tricky, tricky. We're gonna go to this side because you don't really have traffic coming. Fifteen sounds like a good number today. All right, y'all. So. We just pulled up. I'm gonna get checked in. Well, that took long enough. It is packed in here today. Let's see how long it takes. I need to start this way. I'm thinking. I might go by the car wash because I really need to spray my car off like bad. It hasn't had a bath in a very long time. So maybe that's what we'll do next once we get groceries and then we'll head home. So I just checked my substitution for my Walmart order and a couple things that I needed um, they didn't have. So we're walking in just as soon as I get these in here and I get parked and then we'll go to the car wash because I really needed that little um, outlet thing and there was something else. I can't think of what it was. Oh, it was like a little kimono thing. Um, I like wearing those to work. Um, so yeah, we got to go in there and see if we can find those or not. They are probably there. They just... Maybe didn't look for him in the right place. Let's hope. My life is all I am. Yeah. This is what I come in here to look through. I have this one already. But I was trying to see. But 
This one's cute. I just really don't want their stripes. And I don't want a solid pink one either. I don't know. They've got a lot of these um, joy spun pajamas on Markdown. Those are super cute. And there's the top for it. Super cute. These are so soft. $11 for some pajama pants. And I have one of these nightgowns. And you're talking about comfortable. And they're also the Joy Spun. And they're 11 So those are nice. Alright, so I need to find one of these. You can find it on here. Well, that's got a night light in it too. I think that one would be cool. It gives me three. Actually, it gives me six. I think I'll get that one. Got some wax melts on sale. Sheer tuberose. Mm, yeah, nope. Too much of a flower. Get that on sale. Champagne and white peach. Those are nine fifty. I don't guess I need them. <laughs> I have some Pioneer Woman's markdown to four forty nine. These are 450. See, because they've brought in her new pattern. Those are pretty. Y'all can definitely tell that back to school is tomorrow. Well, this week. <laughs> um, because that store was packed. So now we are going to go on to um, the Dollar Tree real quick. They could make these spaces any tinier. <laughs> so we are going to go into the Dollar Tree and then we're going to go to the car wash and get home. We might go to the car wash, but it's looking like it's going to pour. So I might have to hold off on that. <laughs> To make it whatever she put her mind to Late night hours up the hill Serving coffee to strangers Talking about revenue She kept dreaming of a world Big enough for everyone But she knew it must rain before it grows She kept dreaming of the day Butterflies survive the wheel even though she could knock down and never showed Feel it That was a little bit of a disappointment. I've been seeing all these other people share all this cool stuff that they've gotten from, there was somebody coming behind me, from Dollar Tree. So I was like, yeah, I'm gonna go in there, have some time. No. 
I did not see nothing that I had to leave that store with. Um, so I left it in there, sadly. But I am gonna go and spray this car off real quick. So let's go to the car wash. Open up the window I'm breathing in the last of September I can feel the wind blow And the late summer sky is like a giant ember Since I was a little child Every year for as long as I remember All the leaves were running wild Going all the way until November All right, so I'm going to show you these tomatoes before we get this um, new socket put in right here. I do have some carrots right here that I got from Kroger's. They're rainbow carrots. I need to go ahead and get those canned today too. Uh, I'll have to cook those in the pressure cooker, but that's okay. The tomatoes for the pasta sauce, we're just going to use this Mrs. Wages pasta sauce mix. And we're going to get this done. I don't know if I'll film much of it. I might show you like steps or just like periods along the way, I should say. But I'm gonna flip you around and show you these maters first. I just gotta take the core out. I should have done that before I froze them. That's neither here nor there. So let me flip you around and show you. All right, so these are the tomatoes. They do shrivel down, but that skin, you know, it's gonna come right off if I want it to, but I'm just gonna take this core out and get it in a big bowl. And I'm gonna blend those up and then pour it into my saucepan that way. All of that you can't even tell because you got vitamins in that skin too. Um, so we're going to go ahead and blend all that up too and make some pasta sauce and can those carrots. And my oh my, I still got to make so some. So I'm definitely going to be a busy bee today and it's already one o'clock. So I'm on a timer. Let me tell you that. I need to get everything that I need to get done by at least 4, 4.30 so I can start on supper and in between while the pasta sauce i think it's got a water bath for like 40 minutes for quarts if i'm not mistaken um if i can find a video or anything i'll link it below if y'all want to try to make some but yeah i gotta finish putting up the groceries as well because i just finished that grocery haul if y'all missed it i will link that below too because y'all will be seeing this after the grocery haul So I got this first batch ran through there. I am gonna put it through the food meal though and kind of get the rest of it out. And then I'm just gonna keep on doing this and then we'll make some more sauce. All right, y'all, so it took me right about an hour to get all those tomatoes done, <laughs> which I knew it would take some time just because, you know, of all the tomatoes that I had. I did dump some of them in here, so it's not like seedless, but it's good. So I'm gonna go ahead and pour those seasoning packets in here. Oops, 
put some onions and stuff in there. And okay, we'll be ready. So in goes both of these of the Mrs. Wages because we double batch those tomatoes. It only called for six pounds. I definitely had more than that. <laughs> so we have put both in there. And now we are just gonna whisk this together and then we'll get it to a boil and let that simmer for a little bit because I've got to wash my jars. I've got to do some other stuff around the house. So this will just kind of cook until I need it to be finished <laughs> and I'm ready to can it. So if you can hear me over pepper, I did add some Badia Complete in there and some other seasonings like black garlic and then just some garlic cloves are also in there. So we're just gonna let this cook on down and get happy. All right, y'all, so the tomato or the pasta sauce is cooking. I went ahead and got these jars ready. I washed and sanitized them. I've got them packed. I need to go get my cannon salt and we're gonna pressure cook those for 25 minutes and then um, get the rest of our stuff done. Like I need to wash these dishes. I gotta put all this stuff up from cannon. I'm still trying to eat. <laughs> um, we all think about the curtains. I think they're cute, but yeah, I've still got to put the rest of the groceries away, so that'll be fun. And then we got to say hi to Macy. Hi, Macy. Want to say hi, baby? His beard is doing so much better, both of theirs, actually. Isn't it, honey? Yeah. We'll go back here. We'll see where Pep's at. Him's curled up on the couch, snoozing away. Waiting on mama cooking, huh? And here's beard is doing good. I think he's got a tooth that's bothering him though. I'll um, have to brush those out. You checking on Baba? Huh? Are you checking on your brother? Oh, you giving mama kisses. Thank you, my sweet boys. You can't turn the tide. To go where it wants to go You can run and hide You can bury yourself beneath the stone Somebody told me don't pretend everyone... Alright, so we're going to make an Alabama white sauce and for it, it calls for horseradish I don't particularly care for horseradish, but um, I've got some lemon juice, some Worcestershire. I use hot sauce instead of the horseradish. Some mayo, black pepper. It doesn't call for onion powder, but I like putting it in there. And then of course some salt. And I've already got my mayonnaise in my jar. I'm cutting it down by half. Um, so if you want the full, you would use two cups. I'm only gonna use a cup. So let's go ahead and get this put together. All right, so I've got my mayonnaise in there. We're gonna go ahead and start with the lemon juice. We're gonna, like I said, cut it down by half. We're gonna do the Worcestershire. And then I gotta open up my hot sauce. So it doesn't rain out of Now, if you didn't wanna add it or make it spicy, you don't have to. Um, I do like a little bit of heat, so that's why I like to put that in there. And then we're gonna do the salt or the pepper <laughs> and then the salt and some onion powder. And we're gonna give this a shake together. Can't really shake it until you put your vinegar in there. I just have white distilled. I don't have apple cider. It does call for apple cider, but it'll be all right. So we're just gonna go with a quarter cup of the vinegar. And now I've got a little shaker ball in here. I'm just gonna put this lid on it. We're gonna shake it up and then we'll give it a taste and see how it's tasting. I will have the recipe linked below in my description. Box. All right, y'all, so I've just got these peppers and onions in here, um, just simmering on up. I did put a little bit of Badia complete in there along with some water so that Cahoots could cook down and get caramelized. There is a little bit of butter in there. <laughs> so we're just going to let these cook on down. That's so pretty and it smells so good too. But we're going to go ahead and put that lid back on. I'm going to cook the smoked sausage in the air fryer. So the next thing you'll be seeing is supper. Supper. 